Alright, so this is going to be a longer video, and the reason I say that is because it's pretty fucking long for me, <laughs> and what it is is a lot of people show you what it's like when you get to the castle, or you know, just any shit like that, and I noticed that there's no videos that show you exactly how to get there, how to get to that first gate when you walk, when you first spawn in, you know, all that, and there's glitches to it, I've seen some glitches where you can jump over the fence and all that. But most of them show you right when the carriage picks you up. Yeah, it don't really show you much of how to join the covenant or anything like that. And this video is going to show you exactly how to get there. And as I made it there as somebody talked me through. And it's going to show you exactly where to go. And it's pretty much, I mean, if you get the katana, you have to beat the beast that's there. You know, beat the boss. And you put on his crown. And you light the lamp, put on his crown walk in and you kneel before the queen and it becomes in your store for like fifty thousand dollars and it if you leveled up i've leveled up like the two or three and it, it's all right <clears throat> i really like my sword i max my sword out and if y'all need to know where to find a blood chunk i think that's what's called the you know the last one when you hit level nine whatever it's called i can show you that we've only found one so i can show you where to find that I don't know if I'm going to be able to post this because I, I actually was just live streaming and my internet crashed. I'm not really for sure why. But it did. So I figured I'd go ahead and record the video and have it ready and then get it going as soon as fucking possible. As soon as possible. But for this stuff right here, I didn't really explore much. I didn't see where, like... If you notice, I started walking down a pathway, and he told me to turn around. I have no idea where that takes you. I know when this big motherfucker hits you, you can see my health bar, what it done to it. He hurts. Bad. Like, it, it is terrible. But, I just kind of run straight through, and would say it's straight there. So, I'm sorry I didn't record it while I was figuring it out. I've been trying not to do that much. For the simple fact, you know, taking it off the stream, the quality is shitty. It's absolutely shitty. And it's easier to do it this way. It works better this way. It's just every once in a while I do stream, you know, if I'm talking and we're being goofy and shit, I'll take it off my stream and put it in. Just so y'all can get a giggles and shits. And all that wonderful stuff. But, uh, when you, as you go up through here, trying to remember, hey, it puts you back at the spawn. You know, when you walk through there, you end up going back to the spawn and that little metal gate that when you walk out and you look to your right and you ain't figured out how to open it whatsoever well it's here this is how you get behind it this is how you make it open and yeah that's I mean I didn't need it really this long of a video because I ain't got much to talk about if I put another song in it for some reason it wants to give me a copyright strike even though I use songs that ain't copyrighted but it keeps it keeps like flagging it up and I can't monetize it so that's that's a bitch it really is a bitch and for anybody just kinda starting out I will post a video when it, when it gets a little bit bigger and I'll tell you how to get sponsored by the people I'm sponsored by and your channel don't really have to be that big you just gotta have some views it's kinda it's kinda simple it really is they're there to help a lot of things as good as like I don't know, uh, Machinima. That's just one good example I can really think of. It ain't as good as them. But, you know, it's, they're decent. They do pay. If that's what you're interested in, you know, they do pay. And they do help you get your videos out there. It helps a lot. So, I can leave a link for that. If y'all want that. And y'all will be referred by me. And it, it just ends up helping a lot. But we got like, God, we're only three minutes in, four minutes in, something like that. And we, we still got a minute to go. It takes me a minute to get there. It's, it's a travel. I kind of kill everything on my way instead of running straight through and I explore as I go. But, yeah, that's, I'm, I'm not used to making long videos, so it kind of just, kind of sucks. I wouldn't say it sucks, it just makes it, I don't know what to talk about. So I really hope y'all are enjoying Bloodborne, and I know the last time I checked my video, we're like, 
Oh god, we're past 1600 views. Which is amazing to me. Like, it's absolutely just uh, amazing. So. I'll say so one more fucking time. Or yeah. It's either so or yeah. That's. I don't know. I'll say I don't know. I just kind of pause on everything. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with me. It's just not one of my nights. And but. I'll say but a lot. Hmm. Anyways, that's another one. But you'll see you go through here, kill her. Make sure and kill her. Because if you don't kill her, she becomes a boss later on and she will fuck you up. She has a health bar like no fucking other. And for some reason, I don't know why it's not including sound. It usually does. But my capture card didn't record the sound for some reason. I really decided why. I'm actually looking at it right now. And it's... It's frozen. But, let's see. Audio. Audio input. HDMI. I don't know. Maybe I need to turn my game sound up more. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure that out later. Maybe. Because I ain't, ain't gonna be really... You ain't gonna send me fight the boss. I'm just gonna kinda take y'all there. And y'all will see the castle. Y'all will see the carriage ride. All that wonderful stuff. And... Once you walk into the castle, you go to the right, and you'll find the sword that has a gun on it. I don't really know the name, because I sold it, so I can't check it. I thought it was shit, but it mine uses it. You see me check my stats, because I'm talking as I go. And my buddy can see it. You know, we're doing a share play thing, so. But, uh, when you go in there, and you go to the right, you'll see a, a chest, and it's got the sword with a gun built in on it. So, okay, they make it easier to parry people. I guess you could say. It'd make it a little bit easier. I don't know why the fuck I'm just standing there. I don't know what the hell's wrong with me. What am I doing? Why am I just standing there? Okay. Anyways. And then what do I find in this chest? Well, yeah. That. But you'll get that. And then watch out for the ghost. Like the little ghost bitches will pop up and they will, they'll fuck you up. When you go up to the ladder, you'll notice when you get up there, you have to open a bookshelf. When you open the bookshelf, it'll kind of take you to, uh, there'll be a ladder on the side of the bookshelf. And, uh, it just kind of, you just kind of climb up it and it takes you there. Which, yeah, I mean, I really do appreciate all the support I've been getting and stuff off the videos. It's absolutely amazing. It is fantastic. I know I can't tell y'all enough. It's just... I, I didn't expect it. I mean, I, I knew the video would help a lot of people out. Because we, we struggled on it. But I didn't think it hit, like, that hard. And we figured it stopped, you know, around a 1,000. And then after it hit a 1,000, we figured, well, 1,300. And then it, it went past 1,300. And I'm saying, I'm saying it'll stop about 1,700. The views will finally kind of slow down a little bit. But I don't know. It's just y'all are just hitting it up. Now, I noticed we had a few dislikes. With people done the dislikes, if it, there's something that I'm missing that kind of explaining to you, then just kind of let me know there. It would, I could help out a lot. And, you know, just kind of, criticism is always good. It helps a whole bunch. It does. But, yeah, where am I at right now? I lit that lantern. I'm about to lock that lantern. For some reason, my dumbass went to the hunter's mark. For some awful reason. I don't even remember why I was recording this. But I kind of kind of just feel dicked around to this whole thing. After I get into a game, I forget that I'm recording. I'll forget that I'm live streaming. I'll sit there and I'll talk shit. Look, there's the house burning down. But the end boss battle. Oh my god, the end boss battle is... He's he's a bitch. But y'all seen my stats right there, and y'all seen my stats a few times through this. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't really recollect what I'm doing. Oh, buying vials. Okay, and end up going back. But I'm gonna be doing some dungeon stuff too. So I'll post some videos on the dungeon, and then we're gonna get back to you know like our Minecraft and stuff like that, which a lot of people enjoyed, and a lot of people did. More people enjoyed Bloodborne than anything. 
I'm just trying to kind of think of what to do with it. Since, you know, I'm, I'm about to beat it. I really don't know what to do. So, yeah. I mean, I just said two things I really didn't want to say. Because this video is going to kind of suck since I don't know what to talk about. But I hope this really does help you all. And that's what I'm out to do is the people that do view it and do play this game. I hope it helps. This is the main part that you need to see. Don't walk down in here. There's no purpose walking into here at all. I'm sorry, I kind of got up subject. I'll get back to it. But you go out through there and kill what you see me kill. Kill that. Because when it goes into the cutscene, they will kill you. They will fuck you up. I already got fair warned on that, so I figured I could pass on the wonderful knowledge. And then you just walk up to that tombstone. And you get in the carriage, and then boom. You're set. But before I end this, because I'm going to let y'all see the cutscene, even though y'all can't hear anything, and y'all see what goes on, just so you know, it is legit. I hope this does help a lot of you out, because a lot of people ain't posted it. And that's what I'm here to do here to do is to help y'all out and make sure everything works right for y'all and that way y'all can enjoy the game without you know anything stopping you or you just getting frustrated and you know just kind of quit because this is an amazing game it is absolutely amazing and I know that in June we will be doing Elder Scrolls online and that's what like I'm so fucking excited for Elder Scrolls online and you'll be seeing a lot of that. But, yeah, I hope y'all enjoy. If y'all need help, comment your PSN below. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. If we get 5 likes, 10 likes, somewhere around in there. You know, some positive feedback, even if it is negative feedback. Just let me know what's up. Let me know what y'all want to see. My da da all that wonderful bullshit. Don't forget to subscribe. And, yeah, hope y'all enjoy.